फन विद मैग्नेट क्लास सिक्स चैप्टर थर्टीन फर्स्ट पार्ट फन विद मैग्नेट इन दिस चैप्टर वी विल स्टडी अबाउट हिस्ट्री ऑफ मैग्नेट मैग्नेटिक एंड नॉन मैग्नेटिक मटीरियल्स नेचुरल एंड मैन मेड मैगनेट्स मैग्नेटिज्म एंड मैग्नेटिक फील्ड प्रॉपर्टीज ऑफ मैगनेट यूजेज ऑफ मैगनेट एंड प्रिजर्विंग मैगनेट children imagine if you wake up one day and find that you have the ability to attract things towards yourself would not it be the fun do you know that there is a material in this world which attracts iron object towards itself and this material is called a magnet now history of magnet a long time ago in greece in a place called magnesia a shepherd was herding his sheep his name was magnus he was wearing thick boots having iron nails on them he also carried a wooden stick having a metal tip when he reached a large black rock he found that he could not move as his boots and his staff got stuck to the rock staff means a long stick having a metallic cap at its end children you are seeing in the pic the boy is carrying this metallic stick now he dug up the earth to find a black rock which stuck iron things to it and it is believed that because of magnets of magnesia the rock is called magnetite some people believe that the chinese also knew about the properties of magnetite around the same time almost 4000 years ago they knew about a hill near river indus which contain a stone that could attract iron they also discovered that a needle made of magnetite when floated on water always points in the north south direction it was used to guide the sailors and the travelers therefore magnetite was also called lodestone lode means lead the pieces of magnetite were called magnets children in the pic you are seeing magnets of magnesia and the magnetite of or lodestone lodestone this is the natural magnet magnetic and non magnetic materials the materials which are attracted by magnets are called magnetic materials magnetic materials are those materials which are attracted by the magnet for example iron cobalt etc those materials which are not attracted by magnets are called non magnetic materials for example wood eraser etc magnets were believed to have magical healing power queen of greece cleopatra used to sleep on a block of magnetite this is for your information activity 1 to identify magnetic and non magnetic materials for this activity collect a few items from your surrounding take help from the list given below you can also add more item to this list the name of the object fork eraser needle scale thread metal cap coin can iron scrub etc Now hold a magnet in your hand. Bring it near an object. Observe whether the object is attracted by the magnet or not. And note down your observation in the chart given. And we can say the fork. It is made up of iron or steel, so it is attracted by the magnet. Eraser not attracted. Needle. It if it is of iron, then it is attracted. so out of these thing these object which we have selected only the object which are made up of iron nickel or cobalt 
are attracted by the magnet so they are magnetic material and those which are not attracted by the magnet they are called non magnetic material like eraser plastic scale thread okay metal cap now the topic is natural and man made magnets the magnets made from lodestone are called natural magnets and it was discovered that magnetic substances could also be converted into magnets such magnets are called man made magnets man made magnets can be temporary or permanent depending on the methods used temporary magnet attract magnetic materials only for some time permanent magnets always remain magnetic even if they are break into two parts each part act as a magnet magnets can be of many shapes for example a bar magnet a horseshoe magnet a cylindrical or disc shaped magnet button shaped magnet children here you are seeing pick a diagram of different shapes of magnet ball ended magnet cylindrical magnet bar magnet horseshoe magnet and disc shaped magnet only magnetic substances such as iron cobalt and nickel can be turned into magnets they can be converted physically by single touch or double touch method electricity is also used to make magnet sometime and the process of changing a magnetic substance into a magnet is called magnetization can any piece of iron be converted into a magnet we will discuss this in our next video